Even the women are getting in on this. This is great. It's great for boxing. We have Anna Grittenberger. Our first ladies bout of the night here, Jimmy. Mew Seppo in the red corner, boxed on our show last year. She actually fought uh, Nadia Barber, who I trained for the fight. And Mew gave her a fantastic fight. Went three hard rounds with, uh, with Nadia, who was a murderous puncher. This Anna Grettenberger, she looks like she means all business here. She does, and a self-paw as well. Yep. Ooh, Seppo is really on top of her here, though. Seppo, very, Seppo's very busy. Up. Very busy. Oh, 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 oh. 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 Yeah. A lot of punches from these two already. It's only the first round. Anna trying to fire back here, weathered the storm early on. A lot of nerves going into the fight. Particularly from you, I can certainly see that after last year's fight. It was it was a very hard fight for her, so I can see her coming in here a little bit a little bit keyed up. Now she looks like she's settling in a little bit. Primarily a Muay Thai fighter is Muay Seppo. Well, she's doing well with her feet here. Uh, uh, Anna's a southpaw here, and it doesn't really seem to be affecting uh, Seppo very much. Seppo backing off and moving a little bit, trying to circle, Ooh. get into position. Nice, nice, nice one two there from Seppo. <laughs> little problem there with uh, Anna's headgear. Referee Dan Conway, he's got it under control. Seppo in some nice combinations. She's not throwing one at a time, not loading up, just letting her hands go. Three, four punch combinations using her hand speed, not a lot of power. And a good, exciting round. I would tend to probably lean toward my Seppo in that fight, yeah. yes. Very busy. Very busy. And she stayed relaxed as, as the round went on. She kind of got into her own rhythm there. Don't forget, get your t-shirts and hoodies from Reebok. <laughs> You see Anna's corner telling her, move to your left, move to your left. Yeah, she's not fighting like a southpaw, Jimmy. She's not getting herself into the right position. Let's see if she's able to make that adjustment this round. Yuseppo, a week ago, did not know who her opponent was going to be, had been training for an orthodox fighter, and upon knowing that she had a southpaw in front of her, had to adjust her training and her balance and style a little bit. She seems to have made the adjustment pretty well. Fix, they got to fix Anna's headgear there. She's having problems with that. She had it down over her eyes a second ago. She's back in her corner now. They're going to fix that. I think her hair is coming down out from under it and getting into her eyes as well. Seppo is doing really well. She's really staying on top of her here. She's not giving her any breathing room. Okay, back at the action. There you go, there you go. Yeah, Seppo's got her in the corner. Ooh, Anna spins out nice. Good move. Yeah. Ooh, Anna good. lands a nice little yeah, yeah, left, left hand down there. the right down the pike. Oh. Loading up a little bit is Anna against her taller opponent who just takes a slight step out and gets out of range. Nice body shot by Anna. Anna's firing back pretty well this Ooh, round. Anna threw a nice hook to the body there. That was nice. Seppo looks like she's kind of taking her time and being a little bit patient now. Probably wow. behoove her to make her distance, step around to her left. Anna's landing some good body shots. They don't seem to be affecting Seppo too much, but she is landing them. And now Seppo has her in the corner. And that's the end of round two. And around two. Closer round, closer round. Much closer round. I think Anna got a little bit of confidence in that round, maybe found her timing a little and was able to land a few shots, particularly a few decent body shots. 
Whereas I think Seppo kind of settled in a little bit as well, Jimmy. Yeah. First round, I think, was a lot of nerves. Yeah, a little nerves. They came out throwing a lot of punches, then they kind of <laughs> settled it down. She is a superbly trained act athlete, however. Mew Seppo works at MIT, right up the street from Redline Gym in, gym in Cambridge, and tends to take her lunch hour at the gym. Yeah, it shows. She looks very lean. She's in shape. Conditioning is one of the biggest, biggest things in this sport. It's 90% conditioning. You either can fight or you can't. Conditioning is key. As, as Hemingway said, fatigue makes cowards of all men. That's true. Don't usually get many Hemingway quotes at amateur <laughs> boxing events, Jimmy. We don't usually have too many scholars with us either. <laughs> And we're underway here. Final round. Seppo's got her moving backwards, getting her into the corner. Well, Anna's coming right yeah. back. She's firing. And Anna's being a little smart in there, too, you know? She's moving that head. Goody Petronelli told me a long time ago, make a short fighter shorter and a tall fighter taller. And, and Anna, who is at a height disadvantage, is getting a little bit low underneath, bobbing and weaving under Mew Seppo's shots, yeah, which is giving the opportunity for some nice counter punches. Yeah, some good head movement right there by uh, Anna. See, in a case like that, that, that heavy aggression kind of works against you because you're in there throwing a little bit wild. You're going to start missing. If you take your time and pick your shots against somebody like Anna, she's going to settle in. Always fight at your own pace and your own rhythm. Ooh, Anna nice, going nice to the body. Oops, Seppo lands a nice left hook there. See, those body shots may be slowing Seppo down just a bit. Uh -huh. uh, Seppo's got her in the corner again. Ooh, ooh, big right hand there by Seppo. Another right hand by Seppo. Ooh, nice counter punching by Seppo. Very nice, very nice. Ooh. Great job, great fight. Love Excellent fight. Excellent fight. Jimmy, oftentimes on these shows, it's it's the women that provide the real action. It is sometimes. It's true. As all of tonight bout, tonight's bouts are, they are no decision fights. These are strictly exhibitions. There is no winner or loser. The winners are the recipients of the Fighting Chance Foundation charity. All right, let's hear it again for my Seppo from Finland and Anna Grittenberger from Peter Wilson's gym. Is that Ireland? Ireland. Yeah, that's all. Yeah. 